Good morning, it's David at Pacific Toyota and Lexus of Cairns giving the virtual tour of our 2016 Toyota Prado GXL. Before we get into it, I want to quickly introduce you to our dealership. Obviously, it gives you a better idea of who we actually are. Um, so we're standing in one of our two pre-owned vehicle yards. We're stocking over 130 cars at all times. Obviously, today we've got 180 on our website, so quite a uh, few to choose from. We've got our showroom, which is just there. So that's where all the photos get taken. Obviously, where we all sit and do it, obviously all our work, and obviously where the admin team live as well, um, also there. So it's a lively office. Got the other section of the yard just there. So just across the road here, we've got our Lexus of Cairns dealership and also our service center as well. So we've got our Lexus service center, our Toyota service center, and also a service center for all makes and models. Um, we've got our Lexus new car team there, I just mentioned, and also behind that's the Toyota new cars. So that's where all their new cars have been delivered and sold there as well. So back to the Prado, and I'll be as honest as I possibly can for you, as I said on the phone. In regarding the Prado, we'll start off at the front. As you can see here, we've got our so the fog lights, uh, we've got chrome trimmings as well, the, the headlights. You can see the, the teardrop headlights. So it's a 2016, the 2.8 litre model. It's good that it's a little bit ramped up so we can actually see underneath it. But a, a car of this nature done 40,000 Ks are very, very good. See that front bar is very, very nice. We've obviously got the, the dark bonnet protector, makes it stand out a little bit better. And obviously get a nice set of black wheels there as well. Um, so we've got some really, really good tire depths there as well. As you can see there. Very, very good. We'll start off at the passenger side and work our way around back towards the driver's side and then we'll go through the, the whole car. So I'm actually looking forward to see if we can see any sort of scratches or, or anything like that. There is one that I did see just before, which is just here, a little crease just there. And then you have to probably really look at it to try and find it. Have a look on the roof as well. No sign of hail damage or anything like that, so which is really, really good. Obviously, do the comprehensive car history reports is on the cars, so to point out anything like that. Get your tow bar. So they're reversing camera, reversing sensors. Seven seater. So obviously, all the seats do fold up. good some models don't so here you have all the toolkit this might be just a spare compartment it is just to put some stuff in it going towards the driver's side now so you obviously got your weather strips there as well now the wheels slight scuff mark I just see on, on this one here so I obviously wanted to point that out to you as well. But other than that, on this side, it's very, very nice. Obviously you got your alloys there, which are good, and, and tie depths are really good there as well. So we'll go inside the car, and I'll show you obviously inside to, you know, how the fabric is, and all the seat, and obviously the, the carpet, and, and all that. As you can see, the rear seats are very good. Same with the, uh, the floor as well. You've got your aircon control there as well, so the rear has some aircon, which is really, really good. Your hood lining. So jump inside the front now, get out of this heat. The window controls are there. Hit the start button. I had the keys in my pocket. So 43,999. I reckon just about to take over to 44. So you've got obviously got all your radio controls are here. Sat nav, that's all there as well. Press the camera. Did notice as well behind the mirror, you do have the driving camera just there as well. It's pretty handy to have. As you can see there. Hit that button, box in the diff, flex 
takes it away. 4x4 is all there as well. So you've got the electric braking as well. So I can mention that for you. Get there. Mirror controls, and as I said, the push starts just there. Volume, Bluetooth, it's all there. And you've got your cruise control, which is most important. Show you the so I can't show you the personal details in regard to the car, but I did mention to who owned it before. Uh, and it's, this is the service history. So 10,000 was done, the 20,000 was done, 30,000 wasn't, and the 40 was. So one out of four ain't bad. And yeah, we've just done that service not too long ago at all. So, which is really good um, in regarding, you know, the type of car it is and the kilometers. I think it's a very, very well presented car. And what I'll quickly do for you as well is I'll show you underneath the, the hood, just so you can obviously see the, uh, see the engine and we could check out like if there's any red dirt or anything like that. As you can see there, very nice and clean. 2.8 litre, new style turbo diesel engines. I've got room for a dual battery. All of that. So, overall, for a car with this age and case, I think it's a very, very nice looking car though. But if you've got any questions, or obviously we can definitely work out a deal. Um, looking forward to having a chat. Talk to you soon.